As Americans, we consume. We buy, we enjoy, we wear out, we use up, we throw away. And how we throw away. The average American throws away almost 2,000 pounds of trash every year. Most of that trash, almost 60%, ends up in landfills. But many landfills are already full, and some are leaking toxic materials into our groundwater. We need to be looking at a better way to do things that's environmentally sound. Uh, we have not been environmentally sound for 200 years or so in this country. We just find a place in the ground, uh, throw trash, we cover it up. We don't look at the pollution problem that it will create in the future, the water and air. We need to be looking at doing it a better job in a cleaner way. Trash burning incinerators get rid of trash, but in the process create ash that requires special hazardous waste landfills for disposal. Pyrolysis, unlike incineration, destroys waste in an oxygen-free atmosphere, virtually eliminating all harmful and toxic substances while producing valuable byproducts and energy. It is time for us to move forward, and these new technologies, pyrolysis, IES, these new technologies are the future. That is a very clean source of waste reduction, as well as a, uh, an opportunity to really make a huge impact on the amount of trash that is reduced in, in central landfills. A global leader in pyrolytic technology, International Environmental Solutions is revolutionizing the way communities around the world are converting their waste to renewable, safe energy, reducing landfill volume by up to 92% and generating environmentally clean and profitable electric power. The pyrolytic uh, gasification process requires less uh, energy to run itself. Also, looking at the uh, maintainability of the system uh, is greater, it's easier than other uh, systems and lower temperature uh, compared to other competing systems the durability uh, is greater and therefore the economics on this uh, here in uh, California can pay back the system in two to three years. Featuring its uniquely patented product, the Advanced Pyrolytic System, IES offers one of the most innovative and environmentally safe waste conversion processes on the world market today. IES has a new manufacturing facility and commercial waste processing plant in Southern California. Using continuous feed pyrolysis, this new facility is the first permitted commercial processing plant in California using thermal conversion technology. We've seen many systems presented to us. I think that the IES system is the most effective and efficient that I have seen. I'm excited about them being uh, constructed up and running and permitted here in California. Uh, they are the first uh, in the conversion technologies category, and they're creating quite a stir in Sacramento and all over the state, but not only the state, the country, and the world. Each IES waste to energy project site is custom designed and built for the specific needs of the client based on waste disposal requirements and output needs. An IES plant using multiple processing lines can handle thousands of tons of waste per day with systems that can process about six tons per hour. The advanced pyrolytic system has been designed and commercially tested for trouble free operation and minimal downtime. APS patented safety features provide temperature controls at every stage of the process with automatic shutdown mechanisms in place to ensure the safety of its operators and the environment. Specialized processing lines can treat industrial waste, medical waste, sludges, petrochemical waste, and municipal solid waste. APS meets or exceeds U.S. federal, state, and local requirements for air quality and EPA environmental regulations. It is absolutely imperative as a civic leader that whatever we put into process in order to handle our alternative waste uh, requirements, that they be environmentally sound. Uh, I'm, I'm very confident that IES has done the right thing regarding the environmental process uh, in, in, in obtaining their permits. Here's how the IES Continuous Feed Waste Treatment System works. Waste materials are placed on a pre-processing line that will sort, shred, grind, dry, and magnetically separate the debris, eliminating virtually all moisture from the material. The lower the moisture content of the waste, the more efficiently the pyrolytic process will recover energy. 
The waste materials are then conveyed into a pyrolytic chamber that also acts as a thermal converter through a series of valves and gates that are synchronized to prevent unwanted oxygen or air from entering into the process chamber. Municipal solid wastes and other waste streams are exposed to temperatures as high as 1800 degrees Fahrenheit in the absence of oxygen, effectively reducing waste to either a carbon char residue or gas. The gases are then directed to a thermal oxidizer for further degradation, leaving the solid carbon char to drop through a retort chamber floor. Inside the thermal oxidizer, gases face temperatures of up to 2000 degrees Fahrenheit. The oxidized gases move on to a waste heat boiler to capture thermal energy and convert it into high temperature steam. This steam supplies energy to turbine generators which in turn produce clean, cost-effective electrical power. The oxidized off gases are delivered to a spray scrubber to be rendered safe for the ambient environment. The carbon char from the waste is collected for either sale as a useful byproduct or as alternate daily cover at the landfill. I think it's very beneficial that our system is able to take trash that would normally be going to a landfill that has already come out of a post mer facility, a facility that has taken all the recyclable materials that they are able to get out, and we're, we're able to take that and make 99% of it recyclable. Uh, to me, that's very important with where we are heading today. Our landfills are full, and uh, it's very exciting that in the future we'll be able to take care of that problem and make clean, renewable energy with our system. Thousands of pounds of garbage from our homes, offices, and industry converted to clean electrical power or usable byproducts. Environmentally harmful waste chemicals destroyed in the process. Landfill volume reduced by up to 92%. The reason that H-West has maintained their involvement with IEST over the past four or five years is because we do see this as uh, the end to the landfill. And with this we can provide power and zero discharge to the landfill. This product will uh, allow us to mine the landfills, remediate the soil, and return valuable land to usable areas. International Environmental Solutions, bringing innovative waste management solutions to communities around the world, providing renewable, sustainable, clean energy for the cities of tomorrow.